Hello everypony and welcome back to Wolver Plays and today I will be doing Home Sweet Home episode 2. So last last one we saw that Jane got uh, taken by this one strange woman and we'll see what happens in this one. So let's get started. <clears throat> oh, the loading thing is different. Cough a lot. Oh. That must be Tim. Hello? Tim? Oh, Jane. Uh, Jane? Hey, it's Stu. Uh, is Tim there? He hasn't been answering his cell. Oh. Oh, oh, oh hello, Stu. Um, no, no, Tim's not here. He left early today. Something came up and he rushed out. He said he'd call me when he was done. But he hasn't called yet. He must be really busy. What? Really? It's Song Cran Day, and he's still working? Uh, I thought you two made plans to spend your Song Cran at Chiang Mai. We were supposed to. We packed last night and everything, but then this thing came up, and you know Tim, he's all about his job these days. He said he'd be quick. I don't think we can make it now, but whatever. What did you want to talk to him about? Oh, uh, uh nothing really. I was going to ask you guys to buy me some stuff from Chiang Mai, but I guess you're not going anywhere for the holidays then, huh? I guess not. Well, I'll keep myself busy, though. I've been meaning to do some gardening in the yard. <laughs> Maybe it's the time. <laughs> well, that sounds fun. And I wouldn't worry about Tim too much. He just got promoted, and he's very excited about it. As for me, I'm not doing anything over the holiday either. So, hey, if you need a hand with your gardening, I'm just a call away. <laughs> oh, I'll be fine. I wouldn't want to bother you. <laughs> <laughs> it wouldn't be a bother. That's what friends are for. Anyway, I, I better get going. I'll talk to you soon, though. Okay, thanks, Stu. Bye. Bye. And now we're catching up on traffic accidents. Unfortunately, the number of traffic accidents during this year's Song Cran Festival is not less than last year's. Despite police using drink-drive charge as a preventive measure, 53,542 arrests have been reported. The greatest cause of accidents is motorcycles, then public transportation and personal vehicles, respectively. Over 37,000 charges have been filed and more than 900 vehicles have been impounded. There are already 603 accidents reported today. Hey Jane, where are you going? Mm -hmm. Hello? <laughs> what? <laughs> Just a nightmare. It's so real. What? I'm still here. It's still all trashed. I don't think it's string. No. Hey, I'm Tim again. Oh, it's ringing though. Oh, my head. Everything's spinning. Did you drink before going to bed? Yes. I'm so thirsty. One more drink, oh, good nerd. Right? right? No, no, the flashlight. Should we go? 
go? Splash around at the same boat? Or should we go to the Fege? My main goal is to get to Doi, Doi Shafep to pay respect to Buddha. Sam might be a little annoying, but I'm totally tagging along with him. Yeah. Pressing the wrong buttons. Whoopsie. <laughs> what? What? Panic spread through crowds today when a solar eclipse took place without any official announcement from scientists or astronomers. Latest figures show that the phenomenon began at 10 a.m. when the moon began its transit across the sun. <laughs> The eclipse will be complete at 12 p.m., then it will leave sight by 2 p.m. This year's eclipse will persist for as long as the one that occurred in 2002. Meanwhile, Royal Thai Police Commissioner General Prayut Jantra has ordered that all areas be secured by officers who will also be directing traffic, as traffic jams are likely with citizens coming out to witness the phenomenon. This will allow for local vendors to pitch their stall. Eclipse sunglasses are now the most sought-after items during this event. Experts urge you to avoid using normal sunglasses or looking directly at the sun, as it can perilously damage your eyes and could lead to blindness. Sunglasses or films made specifically for this phenomenon are highly recommended. The Astrology Association of Thailand, on the other hand, predicts that the changing of the moon is an ominous event that could lead to chaos and violence. Hey, Tim. I've been trying to reach you, man. Uh, did you turn off your phone? Uh, your colleagues, they're worried about you. And so am I. You really need to take it easy with the drinks. You aren't young anymore. Look, man, I'm here if you need to talk. We all want you to be yourself again. We're rooting for you. Okay. So all that has happened. Yes, I already know about C. Uh -huh. Okay. So is the key over here? Sure is, okay. So now I can go to Jane's room. But why do I not have my flashlight? Ooh. So dark. So scary dark. dark all of a sudden. Suspect suspension order. Dear Mr. Topoli, uh, it has come to our attention that you have violated company policy by being absent from the workplace for an exceeding amount of time. Your conduct has uh, described contributes services and costs for disciplinary action. Normally, this conduct would result in termination from your position without severance pay. However, given your otherwise explanatory service and assistance to the company, your termination has been re-evaluated to suspension for an indefinite amount of time. Please be informed accordingly. This year suspension commences July 8, 2013 and is ineffective until further notice. Size at number 12, move 6, 
Pagnum Rusang uh, came to the police station and reported that on May 29, 2013 at 3.30 a.m. he found out that Mrs. Nuna went missing and hasn't been found yet. What he found in Mrs. room led him to believe that an assault had been taken. This report will be used as evidence of his presence at the scene. Okay. That's a true copy. Alrighty. Kind of that's the people that Jane would probably go to. Got it. the worst dream ever, waking up to find myself in the middle of a dark forest surrounded by the rooting body, rotting bodies of animals and people. It was awful. That setting made me want to throw up. What, what makes me have dreams like this? What is that chanting sound echoing in my head? I can still smell that stench. Before I woke up, I remember walking up to a wooden house. The house was full of wooden figures. There was a body inside, a shirtless man with his stomach cut open. His organs were piled up on the ground. His body looked like a beast had torn him open. Why do I have to see things like this? Why do I have to see, have these dreams? Why Jane, why me? Take notebook. All right. Jane's diary. My Little Book of Happiness. Diary written by Jane. Okay. By Jane. Okay, now what? <laughs> what? Wait, what's going on? Damn it. Oh, what the hell? Get here. Damn, it's dark. I can't see a thing. Reminds me of the place Jane mentioned in her diary. No. Where am I? Sutterbury, reporting live on September 4th, 1959. The strange happenings of Bontheim Village persist and are still observed by frightened local residents. Villagers reporting hear livestock screaming during the night and find the bodies of the slain animals in the morning. Clear laundry hung out to dry overnight appears in the morning to be filthy and covered in blood stains. Mysterious lights roam the distant darkness as if it were alive. The people of the town are terrified and lock themselves in their house as soon as the sun sets. Some of the villagers have even assembled crude fences made from the branches of a monkey apple tree, believing a superstition that such a fence around their home will protect them from the something that is behind these mysterious occurrences. Local authorities are still pursuing all leads to determine the cause of these happenings as they struggle to comfort the local populace. 
A source has told us, however, that if the events continue to escalate, then the local officers may be forced to call in the provincial authority to lend a hand. Okay. Go over here, see what's over here. Oh, we can't. Okay. Bamboo cane. Maybe use to collect objects that are out of reach. Ooh, I can get the axe now. Come on, come on, and give me that axe. Don't know what that was about, but okay. How to perfectly worship spirits. Spirits require con consumption. If you manage to con communicate with the spirits, they will tell you specifically what you they want. If you cannot communicate directly with the spirits, however, it is wise to offer them any food that you can provide. It doesn't need to be anything fancy. The important thing is that you are offering food with a kind and pure heart. An offering? The offerings were saving my progress. The inside might be edible, but I'm not going to try it. What? I'm saving my... So I actually have things to save my progress now? Oh, now that is cool. Ugh. That is amazing. Yeah, the, the lag happened. 
happened to where it didn't really scare me. Oh, look at all this blood. Okay, where are the vampires at? I feel like something's gonna come out of that mud that I just have to...
Jews. I understand that he needs to socialize. I'm such a generous person. <laughs> I had to give myself a little compliment. But on the other hand, I would rather him come back and be with me. It's fine to respect your boss, but he should respect me and my wishes even more. Yeah, Tim, you should respect your wife's wishes. Why are you not? Why are you not respecting your wife's wishes? Alrighty. Let's go in here. Was that a laugh or was that a mouse? Second piece. Tail of a garland. Shrink covered with arranged flowers suspended from garland. See what happened. Okay. Now this one's been tied shut. Are you sure that's a good idea? Yeah, why not? What do we see? Come on! Come on, how many times do I have to tell you? Did your hand get a cramp? Is that why you're so stiff? You're hopeless! What's the point of being my grandchild if you can't pull it off? What a waste! Look at your little sister. Can you show her how to do it? Excellent! Okay, arm a bit higher. Yes, yes, now bend your knees a little more. Oh, that is terrific. You look wonderful. Look at her. You're such a natural. If you oh, become man. famous someday, don't forget about me. Did I see our door open? I heard a door open. door open somewhere. Passing the spirits for a blessing is actually quite similar to how we enjoy a person in general. The real needs to be struck regarding what we ask are asking the person to do and what that he will receive in return. When it comes to communing with spirits, the same principles apply. First, you need to light candles and incense. Then you can ask for a blessing. Keep in mind that you will need to offer something in return. When the spirit grants you a blessing, then you will be required to make an offering. The offering can be any sort of oblation or action that proves you your determination towards the blessing. One of the most famous offerings is dancing. Oh, this 
Looks like it could go. Right there. This piece is like it go right here. And this piece goes right there. There we go. Of 32 herbs will boost blood flow, improve blood cells, strengthen the heart, nervous system, remove fatigue and tiredness, heal skin with infections, reduce toxins, treat chronic wounds, and chemically fresh wounds. It is a top tier elixir treatment. The ground features secret lotus pollen, sea holly, piper, petal, red apple, rosy, vine, white cream flower, human vine. Cardamom, flower, and many others. These are to use healing. These are. They look like siblings. Alrighty. I heard something. I know that. Wait, what's that? the key on the wall.
those offerings right here. Changing my location. I didn't realize that it always changed. I wore that string somewhere.
take it off me. I'm gonna need it to heal. supposed to do? Uh, okay, here we go. I sacrosanct, maybe? <clears throat> I sacrosanct of this area. Please grant me your holy blessing and protect me. In recognition of your blessing, please accept my offering. What should I offer? Crap! the body right here. Oh, wait, this door was locked. How is it open now? I don't like this. Oh, please, no. No, I don't want to do this. Yeah, I go back in that one room, don't I? No? Where am I supposed to go? Oh, 
boiled eggs I took. I do not like this. I do not like this one bit. y'all enjoy the recording and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.